Sometimes, it's the little things that can make big things happen. Fleas and the plague, atoms and nuclear bombs, diminutive leaders in world history. Soot is one of these little things. Soot, also known as black carbon, is released when you burn dung, coal, diesel fuel, and wood. From LA to Mumbai, soot causes respiratory illnesses like lung cancer and asthma, and contributes to 1.6 million premature deaths every year, mostly among the poor. And it gets worse. Atmospheric currents carry soot thousands of miles from where it is produced to the Himalayas and the Arctic. Black carbon, being black, absorbs sunlight, so even a little soot on snow makes it melt faster. And when snow melts, global sea levels rise, threatening our fresh water, indigenous communities, and polar bears who hunt on the Arctic ice. Climate change has been a big thing for a while, and carbon dioxide has been its main cause. Scientists estimate that soot causes 25% of human-caused global warming. It's the second leading cause of Arctic warming after carbon dioxide. Let's not underestimate the impact of this tiny particle. But there's good news. Reducing black carbon may be the fastest way to slow global warming and buy time for the Arctic. Yes, even more so than changing a light bulb. And since black carbon only stays in the atmosphere for a couple of weeks, reducing it would produce results immediately. Of course, reducing soot alone won't solve global warming, but solving our soot problem now will help buy time for the Arctic and allow us to deal with the bigger problem of carbon dioxide. We have the cleaner industries, cook stoves, and diesel. Now we have to use them. In developed nations, we've significantly reduced our black carbon, but we still have much more to do. We need to tighten our standards at home and invest in cleaner technologies in developing nations. In a world going on 7 billion people, you might feel rather little yourself. But if you urge the US government and the European Union to take the lead on black carbon reduction, you can make a big difference. Go to stopsoot.org and help stop these little things from causing big trouble.